Hello Sagittarius, welcome to Truth Well Told Tarot. This is Andrea and I'm here to do your weekly tarot reading for the sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus and it will be from the 1st to the 7th of March 2021. So let's pull your first card. Without further ado, let's get straight into it. We have the, uh, it's a kind of oracle and tarot deck this, so let's see what we have. What do we have for Sagittarius, please? Angels, spirits, guides, message for our lovely Sagittarians. Thank you. Message for Sagittarius. Now I'm going to choose the cards because these are a little bit chunky. <laughs> so let's see what we have for Sagittarius. Okay. I have the Four of Swords, so we have insights that come from meditation, the rest, the need to rest or take a vacation, allow yourself more time before making a decision, mental exhaustion, get more sleep. <laughs> uh, generally the Four of Swords is a card of reflection, contemplation, it's also a card of giving deep thought, generally to re-strategizing, maybe evaluating something. It's interesting, isn't it? Maybe you need to rest as well, Sagittarius, as soon as I get cut the cards. Uh, it's a similar image that comes out. Okay, so what do we have for Sagittarius? Okay, we've got the Angel of Strength, number 50. Message for Sagittarius, please. Message for Sagittarius. I love it. Opportunity. It's a nice big word, isn't it? But it means so much. Very nice energy. Okay. So Sagittarius, I'm going to pull three cards, as you know by now. And then we'll clarify, go deeper into the message. And it won't resonate with everybody, so just take what resonates with you. Okay. Message for Sagittarius, please. Angels, spirits, guides. Message for our lovely Sagittarians. Thank you. First, the 7th of March, 2021. First card out, Six of Cups in the challenge position. Advice from Spirit, Hangy Mam. And we have the Page of Cups, your future outcome. Okay. Can we clarify the cards? Go deeper into the message for Sagittarius. Thank you. Let's clarify the cards and go deeper into the message for Sagittarius. Thank you. First to the 7th of March, 2021. Please, Angel Spirits Guides. Thank you. So we have the death card. The Hanging Man, love it. We have the Eight of Wands. The Page of Cups is clarified by the Ten of Wands, Sagittarian energy. Look, 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 look. We have the Knight of Coins. Love the Knight of Coins energy. Okay, Sagittarius. This is about having courage, strength. I'm definitely getting this energy of... I'm definitely getting this energy of waiting, delays, setbacks, that you might have experienced periods of feeling in limbo on this road to recovery. And you've needed to connect to your strength, your power, your resilience, your resoluteness to overcome something. But there's definitely an energy of just go at your own pace because it's gonna happen. And there's kind of divine timing with this Sagittarius as well. Things happening when they're meant to happen. But for some of you, the recovery is coming, the opportunity is coming. And this is clarified in the cards as well. So I like the fact that the cards are really in sync. Um, difficulty in moving on from the past is definitely evident here. 
The difficulty in emerging in a new path has been evident because you've had setbacks and delays. And yet it is coming. The message is this period of waiting, of being in limbo, of trying to get back on track is coming your way. You will find the joy. You will reconnect to your happiness once more. You will get back to where you were, if not better. So there's definitely an energy here, Sagittarius, of you, you're you almost kind of like going through the process of trying to shed an old skin, but the recovery isn't happening as quickly as you want it to. And that's definitely the energy that I'm getting. There's been a difficulty in moving on from the past. The, and this is clarified in the cards. I mean, the advice from spirit is an energy of, there has been a period of limbo. We find periods of limbo for whatever reason. I mean, sometimes it can be health can affect our money and career. Sometimes health issues can stop us moving or put things on hold. You know, that kind of any energy in other areas of our lives um, can be in terms of money and career, can be in terms of relationship changes. Uh, money and career changes. But the message is that the change you've been hoping for, Sagittarius, the new adventure is opening up for you. Um, the period of limbo, it definitely feels for some of you, is about to come to an end. And there's definitely a sense of divine timing, orchestration, new conversations, new opportunities coming your way. You might find, you know, uh, technology, online communication quite strong. Distance as well, things to do with distance communication as well, or distance opportunities might resonate for some of you. Can also be to do with travel here for those of you wanting a shift or a change or something that involves travel. Um, can also be to do with business opportunity, connections, opportunities, conversations coming your way. The shift is coming, the change is coming. And that's what Spirit is telling you after a period of waiting, there is a shift. There is the new adventure unfolding for you. Uh, and it's divinely timed, divinely orchestrated. Things happening when they're meant to happen. You know, the hanged man, and I love this energy. You see, he goes straight through the card. And it's important that he does because he is a card of alignment. Waiting for that point in time where you're ready to align the light bulb moment, all of a sudden things become clear in how you're aligning to your path. You know, it's that kind of energy. Pages represent the beginnings of something new, the beginnings of change. So there's definitely an energy here, Sagittarius, of things are about to look up. Definitely getting the energy. There may well be something, all of a sudden, I'm definitely getting this energy of there is suddenly the shift. There is suddenly, instantly, shockingly even, the positive shift that you've been waiting for. Something may be unexpected, an unexpected surprise, an unexpected um, occurrence, message, opportunity coming your way that is going to allow you to release the burdens of the past. Because it's a 10. This is Sagittarius. The period of where you've been tested, the period of where you felt powerless, restricted, hemmed in, you will soon be liberating from it. I definitely get that kind of energy. The past journey is soon to be over. The burden, the weight, the tests that you've gone through on that past journey, there is the shift coming. And what is the shift? Well, I love the Knight of Coins energy, Virgo energy. Uh, it's the healing energy of the Knight of Coins that I love as well because he brings in fulfillment. He brings in the opportunity, the offer, the opportunity coming your way. Could be an element of the unexpected, out of the blue here. Swift change. But he represents change, the Knight of Coins. Um, can be offers to do with job offers, business offers, clients, new business, contracts, call it what you will. He comes when hard work has been put into something and we know that you've been working hard. You've been tested. You know, um, 
but the hard work is definitely paying off because all of a sudden and it feels unexpectedly or quickly swiftly um, the opportunity comes and the knight of coins can sometimes be when we wait for the knight of coins to appear it's the slowest of all the knights but when he appears and he is appearing he is the opportunity he brings the golden opportunity he brings the offer the reward um, the positive change that you can build on that you can really build on for the long term you know he's solid stable secure so definitely this energy of this offer is bringing a new level of solidity and security but it's also this recovery energy that i'm getting as well love that energy very much sagittarius um also you might be dealing with a virgo maybe for some of you i mean that could also resonate but i'm definitely getting this energy and it feels so beautiful if things are about to look up and it's very sudden that it's going to happen the night is going to appear it feels like you've been waiting forever for it and then all of a sudden you're waiting and the shift is there okay so i'm going to pull a final card yeah we have solitude think of being alone as meaning you are all one and in total harmony with everything the greatest treasures are those that wait silently during your quiet times really like that energy sagittarius you may have been you may have felt isolated i mean this hanged man may have been a period of isolation i mean we get that with job losses we get that with relationship changes we get that with health issues feeling removed in some way so you might be doing that but you know remember the hanged man is illumination that you get in those quiet reflective times so there could be some reflection energy going on there could be some illumination light bulb moments moments of lucidity on how you need to take action as well to bring change to your situation but I'm definitely getting this energy of the opportunity the recovery is coming your way and it's something solid and beautiful very very beautiful energy so i hope you enjoyed the reading sagittarius if you did please do like share and subscribe i hope it's a wonderful week for you all and i will see you next time thank you